in this lesson, we're going to list all the multiples of 2 and 3. So really what we're going to be doing uh, to find the multiples of 2 and of 3 is really we take the numbers and we're going to multiply these by the numbers 1, by 2, by 3, by 4, by 5, by 6, by 7, by 8, right? all the way to however many we want. So it all depends on how many we want, right? So we're gonna do that of two, and we're gonna do the same thing for three, all right? So two times one is two. Two times two is four. Two times three is six. Two times four is eight. Two times five is 10. And so we can almost figure out that what the other numbers are. We've got 12, 14, 16. So we're going to keep going by twos, right? And they're just, these are a whole bunch of multiples of two. Now let's go to finding the multiples of three. And as we said before, we take the number three and we are going to multiply it by one. We're then going to multiply it by two. We're going to multiply it by three and so on and so on. So three times one is going to give us three. Three times two is going to give us six. Three times three is going to give us nine. Three times four is going to give us 12. Three times five is going to give us 15. And if you notice, right, they're all going up by threes. So add three to 15 and we're going to get 18. Add three to 18 and we're going to get 21. Add three to 21 and we're going to get 24 and so forth and so forth. So here we have listed pretty much all the multiples of 2 and here are all the multiples of 3. Now the question might ask what are the common multiples? Right? So we might be asked for the common multiples of 2 and 3. So what we're going to do is from the results, right, we want to look at what are commonly found in both of them. So if we look in, and I'm going to highlight here, we've got 6, right, uh, we have 12 here and 12, uh, and if we would have continued, um, you know, what else would we have found? And so actually, let me uh, do one more multiple here. This one would have been 18. So another common multiple would have been 18, right? So in other words, if we're being asked, what are the common multiples of two and three? Well, common multiples are six, 12, and 18 using the sets of numbers that we have actually found. Now, using the common multiples, which is different from common factors, we might be asked to find the lowest common multiple. Or also known as the LCM of the numbers 2 and 3. So in order to do that, we are going to take all these common multiples and find which one is the actual lowest. And the lowest common multiple of 2 and 3 is 6. So first, find all the multiples of the two numbers. Find what's common with all the, the uh, these multiples. And then to find the lowest common multiple, you take those common multiples and take whichever number happens to be the lowest value. 